Hi, Jim Steele here with tonight's final thought. I recently found a video from the beginning of my master's program during the week-long tech camp when, uh, because this was the beginning of a, a very difficult process, uh, we would routinely take time out of our day and sit together and just kind of vent and share um, where we were at. And that was called, you know, it was getting uh, off our getting stuff off our chest and that was basically called uh, that we were checking in it's actually been a little bit of time since my last um, video podcast and so I've decided this time instead of taking up some subject that I would just kind of do one of those checking in videos and uh, I did create a list here uh, of stuff that I wanted to talk about and the first thing was my uh, jobastios.com blog uh, previously I had gone to a WordPress group and they talked about how people um, use blogs and how the fewer clicks the better etc etc and so that's where my the previous uh, version of my blog came from was where whether somebody came to my blog through a link from a Facebook um, post or they came to my blog they would immediately find the latest story without any kind of clicking and I kind of got after some time, I got a little bit bored with that. And so this recent version, um, I've returned kind of to my roots into the magazine version. So uh, on the top portion, you have the uh, slider with, uh, I think it's like seven, seven most recent stories. And then if you slide down a little bit, you get the rest of the items. I've got this um, in the spotlight, which is a, a story that I can specifically highlight for many of the stories uh, that I'm working on and then I have all the different categories I have um, a section in the center there with all the photo and media stuff that I'm doing and then I picked out six different categories to populate the rest of the website so I'm kind of I kind of like it um, and I'll probably talk about the the notions of what what it takes you know what what I'm thinking about when I'm, I'm putting together these uh, blog pages so that's the first thing second thing that's happened since uh, my last uh, video podcast is I, I now have a roommate. And so that's a, a very different experience, um, sharing my residence with uh, somebody. And it's, it's working out pretty good. It's a little bit weird. It, it's, it's, you know, it's, uh, just been a very long time since I've had to share my, my living space. Um, my townhouse has got basically two master bedrooms. And so it's, you know, the bedroom with the, uh, attached, bathroom shower facility and so it's almost like two apartments uh, we have the common area downstairs but we keep right now we keep such different schedules that um, we, we're not really running into each other too much and it's one of the sorts of things where we it, it feels like we kind of need to build in some time to talk because uh, sometimes days can go by without a conversation but you know I get it's it's um, I was really concerned because you know it's it's a pretty much a stranger that I've invited to uh, to live with me and uh, it's turned out to be a pretty good experience and and uh, not, not, not much to report after that so uh, work-wise uh, job continues to evolve uh, and that's a good thing uh, you know I'm continuing to have all kinds of challenges um, and the pace uh, at my uh, my school is just crazy and so it's just like one thing after the other um, and, and for me, the, the, the part that I like is that I'm still uh, balancing in uh, what the, this, uh, the demands that are put on me uh, balanced with the feeling that I'm doing something that I really uh, believe in. And so that's, that's a good thing. So in the writing uh, pro uh, projects department, I've had a little bit of a breakthrough on uh, some uh, book ideas that I've been working on. I, I had originally had uh, one book that I was thinking of doing that was more nonfiction, but I was concerned about upsetting possible, uh, well, people that might find themselves in the book. Uh, and, you know, I'm not really comfortable with that. Or And too much would have to be cut out to, you know, to try and et cetera, et cetera. And so... It, you know, it dawned on me when I was working on a short story project that really what I need to do is is um, I had come up with some fictional characters in a short story, and it seemed to fit the bill in terms of creating a backstory for these other projects that I wanted to do. And that's 
<laughs> ridiculously vague. But the point is, is that I think I've got a, a, an opportunity to do some of the things that I wanted to do uh, without uh, getting in anybody's face because I'm, you know, just telling this story. So there you go. Uh, media projects, the photography. Um, so I, you know, recently published some uh, Pepperdine stuff. And I found a lot of videos that weren't posted anywhere and photos that weren't uh, posted anywhere. And so I've been kind of busy uh, mining that material and uh, working with Lightroom to try and uh, manage. It's just, you know, it's 15 years worth of, uh, of stuff. And anybody that's known me knows that I'm the guy that always used to run around and you know, on any given occasion, shoot a good 500 to 1,000 pictures. And so there's a lot of stuff out there. And I don't want to do what I did uh, on my Flickr account, which is basically anything that was semi-passable that wasn't just, you know, a completely blurry image. I stuck out there. And so consequently, you'd see, you know, 350 pictures from, you know, some small event. And uh, it's just kind of, you know, it's a little bit ridiculously overwhelming. And so I'm, I'm hoping to do um, to be able to take these images from these days and, and you know again do some uh, visual storytelling with, with the work and so I'm kind of looking forward to that uh, music my last appearance at the Sleeping Moon never showed up on a Florida Events TV feed and then uh, when I was there for that particular uh, event there was a no cover songs edict that came down which kind of screwed with my set and so wasn't really happy with it and I'm not really sure in terms of what I want to do with my time whether that's fitting the bill and so I haven't I haven't actually uh, been back but I do you know I still want to share and so there's there's part of me that's that thought well hell I've got the equipment here to to do a pretty good recording um, but of course that means it's like well do, do I do overdubs do I add other instruments you know so a, a simple problem has created a, a, an opportunity but as you can see, I haven't done anything about it yet, so uh, so we'll see. But I'm, I'm still thinking about different places that I can go to uh, and possibly going back to the Sleeping Moon. That was fun, uh, but it, you know, in in terms of all the other things that have uh, made demands on me, it, it kind of unfortunately dropped in my priority. Anyway, so that's my thoughts for tonight. Uh, please check my website at jobustillos.com. That's J-O-E-B-U-S-T-I-L-L-O-S.com. Or you could actually find this uh, video podcast at jbbsfinalthoughts.com uh, for any notes, links, or any kind of info related to this podcast. Thank you very much, and we will catch you next time. Bye.